Welcome back to the next episode of Horizon Zero Dawn. We have returned to Mother's Embrace because I am determined to grab these metal flowers. So, let's head off. This one is most definitely down in the ruins with the rest of them. Keep that for later. So, yeah. We're just going to have to go get down there. I'm also going to stop up, stock up my medicines as I pass them by because why would I not? That's just how I do, yo. Alright. Pretty much directly below me. Where are the ruins at? There they are. Obviously the metal flower is in the ruins. Hmm. Well, that's my second death in this game. And you know what? Justified. Deserved. For a brief second, I was like, should I just stop and scrap this recording? But no, you guys deserve to see my second idiot death. Now you know. Wow. You did that fall once as a child, but you can't now? Get it together, Aloy. That was dumb. <laughs> that was really, really dumb. Just, just very, very stupid, really. Alright, let's try that again. This time, more success. Good lord. Alright. We underground. Now then. Metal flower is deep down. Let's go look for it. Yeah, 7 of 63 data points is how many I have so far. The problem is I can't tell if I find more or not. The game doesn't do an ideal job of telling you if you found a new data point. Or an existing one. Rat. Alright, that rat escaped my wrath. Tiny meat! Excellent. Okay, flower is on this level somewhere. Chat is telling me there is something I want here besides the flower, I guess. Okay. I mean, I'll take a look around. Should I be scanning more? Should I just wander around? What was that I just saw? I scanned something. Happy birthday, Isaac. Oh, yeah, that's from when I was quite young. There's some stuff in here. How am I getting in there? Hang on a second. We need to get in there ASAP. Uh, hmm. Stairs back here, maybe? Let's see. Okay, now we need to head back down below. What are you? All this tech stuff, it's hard to tell if something is something or if it's nothing. There's something I want here, it's breakable. Huh. I'm probably going to horrendously miss it unless you're pretty explicit. I mean, I'll look, but... There's some stairs back here. Uh, there should be some stairs back here. Aha! This must be where child me never went. 
No, no, I was here. I remember this. Bats, bats, bats. Well, I mean, if it looks like I've walked right past it or if I'm somehow missing it, you can let me know what I'm looking for. Like, if I see it, point it out, basically. Alright. Keep heading around. Up here, through here. We're approaching. Isn't this where I fell down initially? I feel like I'm going in a circle. Definitely going in circles in here. Hmm. I've walked past two of them? Huh. Okay, I'll take a look for breakables in a bit. So that flower is not immediately obvious. This one's a bit of a mystery, yo. Okay, I think this is the wrong place to be. Let's head back up and explore elsewhere. What have I walked past that is breakable? Never really noticed a breakable object before. Hmm. Suspicious. Not you. Let's head back out of here. Scout your environment. Do a quick scan for anything of value. Actually, that's a good question. We'll scan reveal what I'm looking for. Oh, you dummy! Such strange artifacts. Metal flower mark A. Function true. Light of the moon moves west. Flower shadows creep eastward. So obvious. All right. So there's two of them down here. Uh, let's go try and find the other one. Can't believe that. So ridiculous. Obviously I can break those things. Thanks, LTG. Alright, now where's the other one, though? Yeah, I know what to look for. Is it just two of them down here, or there is there a third as well? How many of those things am I looking for? Not you. That area back there. I wonder if I can find a way into it now that I'm older. Yeah, you can. Power cell. Power cell. I'll need it to get to the armor in that ancient ruin I found. All right. Got one power cell, needs one more. All good things. From Director Evans to all. Subject, all good things. To all staff, I regret to inform you that our worst fears have been realized. The Wichita salient has collapsed and our position will be overrun in less than 24 hours. As I'm sure you understand, exfiltration transport is not available. If you wish to abandon the facility and try your luck on foot, you may do so. Lock 2 will unseal at 2100 hours and remain unsealed for 15 minutes. Godspeed. For those of us who'd rather not die on our feet, there will be a gathering in the community room at 2200 hours, and Nurse Chana will make other means available. I want to underscore how proud I am of each and every person who served at this post. It is important to bear in mind that our sacrifices were not in vain. I hope that makes this a little easier. For months now, I've been signing, signing off as Director Evans, but I suppose we can dispense with such formalities now. Respectfully, Ellen. Yeesh.
Special items, power cell. Battery designed for a mid 21st century military holo lock. Cool. What else we got in here? Some good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Hey, rich. Nice. Can't the weight. Cool. Okay, so I'm going to assume there's another ruin somewhere else where I'm going to find that second power cell I wanted. And then once we have both power cells, we can go back after that weave. Alright. Next up. We're done with this ruins, I believe. I'm fairly confident in saying that. So let's head after this metal flower and we'll do that from this campfire. Nice. All right, I'm, pr I'm really thrilled about that metal cell because there was the quest marker for that quest was still underground near the synthetic weave, but I couldn't seem to find my way to it and I was frustrated with that. But now it makes sense that I need to just find both uh, power cells and then bring them back there and I can get that sweet, sweet armor. I bet the armor rules. I bet it's awesome. Not home anymore. Not without Rost. There's nothing for me here anymore. Oh, there might be. Let me just take a quick scout around, just in case there's something, you know? Can't sneak under the house. Fairly confident I can't get on top of it. Fairly confident I can't get inside of it. Okay, the house is nothing. Alright, now give me a map. Head outside and then... What are you? Hang on a second. What's this about? If I'm trophy hunting, make sure to knock over all those dummies for a trophy. I do think I'd like the platinum, so in that case... No one left to replace them, though. Any other tra uh, training dummies? Yep, got some down here. Alright, pretty sure that's it for training dummies. Ancient ruin discovered Rost's grave. Oh right, they made a grave here. couldn't leave the sacred land without visiting you. When you said goodbye, I told you I'd find you. Track you down. Well, looks like you did it after all. Went somewhere I can't follow. I should have known you'd be watching. At the Proving. Looking out for me. There for me when no one else was. Like always. One last time. Thank you, Rost. I won't waste what you've given me. I promise. I'll make you proud. I've been... trying to puzzle it out, but... nothing makes sense. The killers came after me because I looked like this... A woman, older with short hair. But why? And what's the connection? If she's my mother, then she didn't look Nora, but 
If she lives inside the mountain, how could the killers know about her? The more I learn, the less I understand. I need to track down Olin, an outsider. He was at the festival the night before the proving. Somehow, the killers saw me through his focus. And he knew it. He could have warned me. When I find him, well, he's gonna tell me everything he knows. And he's gonna pay. Well, I... I guess I should be going. I might make a habit of revisiting this place again, if there's more to say each time. Now, is this a data point? I figured it would be a world data point, but no. <sighs> Does this game measure my deaths? No. 15%. If I can do one- If I can keep ahead of my episodes percent-wise, and get 100% before 100 episodes, I'm gonna be pretty happy with myself. That's my goal, I guess. Alright, let's roll out. I think he built all this alone. So many. Okay, so there is a metal flower up here. There is a bonfire down here, and there is a scrapper site back here. And we're definitely going to go investigate that scrapper site. It's not home anymore. Not without Rost. There's nothing for me here anymore. Because I can complete one of my tutorials when I find those scrappers. Aside from that, let's just head out towards that metal flower. Stocking up. <clears throat> hmm. Give me a look over this ledge. Nice jump. Good lord. That was a kick-ass jump. So you're saying there's a trophy for knocking over every training dummy in the game. That's gonna take some effort. That is gonna take some doing for me. Hey, buddy! B. Function true. Evening wind. Water laps. The heron's legs. Cool. We high up right now. Alright, map. I want this bonfire. I will never correctly identify it as a campfire. It's a bonfire. Dark Souls has written that into my video game lexicon. Man, what a good game. Am I talking about this game or Dark Souls? Yes! That's all I gotta say to you. Dang, Aloy! That jump, though. <laughs> Did you just. Was that flip entirely necessary, though? Like, it was a really good flip, but was it completely necessary, is the thing. Alright, let's see if I can descend this cliffside safely. Yeah, I definitely can. Okay. I took a hit. I'll admit it. I'll be the first to say it. Took a bit more damage than I expected to, but it's cool. Let's keep descending. We've got to be on the bottom ground. Tell you what, when I catch those scrappers, I'm going to ruin the... Who is this? That's got to be a watcher. Only watchers have bright eyes like that. Uh, can I pick on any watchers for my tutorials? Humans, fire bellabacks, stalkers, long legs, trip machines, and power cells. Oh, I can definitely do a machine tripping. I'm gonna wreck that watcher, so I need to activate the quest. 
Otherwise, I don't get it counted. Oh, yeah, didn't get wet. Hella. Hey. I've got Cool. Hey, run at me. Hey. I missed my uh, precision shot, but I did get that sweet two shot. So that's okay. That's a boar. I do need to kill that boar. A level! Don't mind if I do. Sound of leaves rustling. Actually, I need three levels. Well, two more now. So, it's gonna take me a second. Where the heck did that boar go? There it is. That meat. Where'd the other ball go? There it is. And doing sliding shots is hard. I appreciate that every level is just, um, the XP cost is just your current level times 1000. So the first level took 1000 XP. The 16th level, well, 17th takes 16,000. Alright. Next tutorial is Wobbo. We gotta get a Scrapper's electric shot, so I need to equip the right bow for that. Electric bow, there you are. These are grounds I haven't actually explored before, so I'm happy to be out here now. I need meat, yo. I make potions out of that. As well as inventory upgrades. But I'm not super desperate for those yet. Mostly it's being able to make more potions that I truly desire. Man, it's beautiful out here. Alright, campfire discovered. Sweet. Let's go get those scrappers. Man, there's some distance away. Didn't get wet. Nice. The game's gotta have some sort of auto adjust to not landing in the water. I can't nail jumps like that so skillfully. Alright, sprint towards Scrapper Town. I see one. However, I need it to not see me. Can I ditch them before they spot me? Three scrappers is a bit much, but I am going to take them all out because I'm curious about what's back here, if anything at all.
just got... Hey. Come fight this! Did I get it? I got it. I definitely got it. Alright, uh, what else are my tutorials? Multiple enemies, humans, fire bellbacks, stalkers, long legs. Okay, so only the blast sling is really doable right now. And I need the right situation to do that. If I spot the right situation, I'll definitely execute on it. But I'm not going to go out of my way looking for targets right now. Mostly I just want to finish off these scrappers and see if anything cool is back here. And I definitely count two scrappers. Couldn't tell you if there's two. Need some grass? Okay, someone's just having a meal. So um, if I can sneak up behind and assassinate them, I will. Because that's how I do. Yeah, you're super assassinated. Purple? Freeze coil. That rules. You don't have the hearing to pick me up, huh, buddy? Scrappers, when they're hungry, are not very smart. Oh, stabbed in the ass. Okay, it was definitely worth coming out here for a couple of legendary modifications. Alright. So we're out here now. What's the deal with this place? Let me just take a brief look around, see if anything jumps out at me. It looks like it's the end of the road, though. Couple animals around. Alright. Looked like it was just a fighty site for some scrappers to hang out and get killed. Alright. Quests. We've got two side quests we can work on right now. We're done with the Nora hunting grounds. We're pretty much done with our tutorials. 38% freeze, 40% shock. That kind of rules. What did I get? Process a metal block. Okay. One skill point. I'm saving up three for knockdown. Because then I can take out Sawtooths pretty easily. Map. Let's consult. I've hit every campfire in the embrace. I've collected everything of note. Outside of it. Done this. The next most thing is this ancient vessel, which I haven't successfully found. Let's warp over here and see if we can do a better job finding that vessel. If I can figure out how to find vessels, I'm going to be pretty pleased. Alright, load me in, please. I'm still bugged I haven't found either of the vessels I looked for. So we're going to take another look and really try and figure it out. LTG, if you're still in chat, can you tell me a little bit about how to identify a vessel? I wandered about in the area where I expected to find one, but it just didn't show up. And I want to know why. Well, that's right. I wanted to fight a bellow back today as well. I don't think that's going to happen. Sometime. Holy crap, that's a sawtooth. 
Why are there sawtooths out here? Okay. Uh, am I gonna pick a fight with a sawtooth? K kind of. What are sawtooths weak to? Fire, I think. Or shock? I don't know, I'm nervous about picking a fight with a sawtooth. Man, I'm right in Machine Town Central, huh? Okay. Let's, uh... Let's start dealing with this. Things were not this wild last time. I need to leave now. How do I hit? Uh, what do I do to sawtooths again? Our body weak to fire, blaze canister weak to fire and tear. Hmm. Where's my rope caster? Give me that. How's my blaze ammo situation? Blast does explosive damage. Does explosive damage count as fire? Get wrecked sawtooth, I guess. Aren't there two sawtooths around here? I hope not. That's the uh, long neck I hear. Striders. Salmon. Scrapper. Watch your corpses I have yet to claim. Okay, no signing of that sawtooth. Besides the fact I used up a whole bunch of ammo, did you notice that I kind of ruined that sawtooth though? I kind of want more blast bombs. Like, that was really well done. Okay, well, I know I can be mean to Sawtooths now. Because I just rooked to the ground a few times, and then I poured fire over it until it died. It was pretty cool. Anyway, we're gonna take another scout around. What are you freaking out about? 
Who is around that is worrying you? The scrapper? Really? Whoa, buddy! How do you cut that out? Alright. Somewhere around here is an ancient vessel. I don't know what an ancient vessel is. I don't know what Ouch. it looks like. I don't know how to identify it. All I can kind of do is wander around within this radius and pray. If I'm lucky, it actually will have a purple marker above it. And that will make it really easy to spot. Just gotta stay in the radius. Is it in here? If I climbed up here with a- Oh, 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 oh! First Amendment Virtual. Editorial. Does the First Amendment apply to virtual spaces? April 29th, 2063. Last week, in one of the biggest synchronized police actions in US history, the homes of more than 700 private citizens were raided, and more than 500 arrests were made for the crime of inciting criminal behavior using private informational processes. If you've been paying attention over the past nine years, you'll know how to parse the above legal word soup. Those raided are accused of participating in a virtual anti-corporate sovereign sovereignty rally, this time at the Holonet headquarters of Sterling Malkeet. Watching 500 people, many of them bloodied and terrified, hauled from their homes by police SWAT bots is, understandably and rightfully, horrifying to a lot of people. But this is nothing new. As far back as 2054, when the first major arrests of virtual protesters occurred over the occupation of Metallurgic International's Holographic Customer Service Center, pundits and courts have engaged in the debate over lost the word, over whether or not the internet constitutes a public space and is therefore legally required to oblige peaceable assembly. Legislation simply hasn't kept up with the advances of the hollow net, and that's no accident. It serves the interests of Sterling Malkeet and Metallurgic and their corporate ilk to treat the holoscape not as a public space, but, in the words of Metallurgic-backed Senator Gerard O'Neill, an array of privately owned information processes. The same O'Neill, data corrupted. Hmm. Yeah, that speaks a lot for the current world we live in. Alright, let's circle around some more. Get back inside that main circle and see if we can... Man, I ruined that sawtooth, actually. It was kind of funny. It was funny in a way. That I just poured fire on it until it died. I roped it to the ground, poured some gasoline over it, and set off some matches. It ruled. Suck it, Sawtooth. That's what you get for scaring me. Stay in the circle, explore your surroundings. Look, 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 find the ancient vessel somewhere, please. Please let me find it and be done with this search. And also know how to identify ancient vessels in the future. I sure hope it's not underwater. That would be rude. Should I kill a salmon? Eh. Well, this didn't work. Not around out here. Man, what is an ancient vessel, though? Could it be across the water?
let's check this building up here. We're gonna wrap up soon, but I really, really- Hey! 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 I'll shake it out later. Ancient vessel, Arkies. A cracked and battered vessel, once dear to the old ones, seems to show the terrain of the Gatelands. Sets of ancient vessels can be traded in Meridian for valuable resources. We did it. We did it. Alright. We've pretty much cleared everything up to this point. So, next episode, we'll grab this ancient vessel here, this bonfire, and move on with the next bunch of quests. We'll work on this area. Clean this out. And we've got all of this ahead of us in the future. Goodness me. Goodness me, so much to see, so much to do. And who knows what's going to happen when we come out to these areas. There's still a whole lot more to do. But for now, we are wrapping up. Thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.